Okay, we're going to continue with part three of the laying out the profile here for the Grumman II teardrop. I'll put my guideline back here in the back. I base everything off of that. Anyway, uh, we'll start laying out the profile or the bulkheads and the shelving. Uh, we'll start with the main bulkhead. It's 32 and a half inches from the back, and it's going to be a half inch uh, plywood. So. We're going to have to put some guidelines in there. And I'll just lay out some other guidelines. Uh, the front uh, or the back of the shelves is going to be there, six inches. And then we got coming up from the bottom, well, actually from the bottom of the floor, we come up uh, 21 inches here. And again, that's going to be a half inch. This is the countertop in the back. And then this will be half inch here. And so I'll go ahead and lay those out or mark, draw those, and then we'll uh, anyway, I draw this, come up. Again, I just draw outside. It'll speed up the process. And uh, then we will have to get a little bit finer to come in here. You want to make sure you hit an inner, inner section point because if you don't it uh, will screw with your drawing possibly you want to make sure everything's on the same plane uh, okay and then we'll come down uh, again now, and then draw down here and and so we got that right there your main ones will Go ahead and delete. Actually, I'll leave that back one. We'll delete those. And then we'll put in some more guides for the remainder of the shelving. Uh, let's come forward. We got uh, 50 and a half inches for the inside. And again, these are, we're actually going to do 3 eighths uh, inches, what I'm going to draw here. Uh, you're welcome to put whatever you want. And for 3 eighths, I just do 3, the divided by 8 sign. And that will give you your 3 eighths. And then coming up from the bottom, this is 24 and a half, and it's from the bottom of the floor here. Uh, and that's 24 and a half. And then again, that's up 3 eighths. So that will give you your back. We'll just leave that for now. And then we'll go ahead and uh, draw the or put the guides in for the shelf in the back here. This is 24 inches from the back. And this is going to be, again, 3 8 And then coming up from the bottom of the floor, this is 32 inches to the top of that. And then 3 8 down. Now you do have to remember where all these guides are coming from or so you don't get on the wrong one but uh oh, well i didn't need to draw it all the way up there that high but it doesn't matter we'll we'll come over and get my intersection point it's a little hard with this video program recording in the background anyway then i like to actually show where the plywood's overlapping uh, I'll go ahead and delete those. And then I'll have to come up here and delete this little part. And then I'll come down here, do this. And I'm using the scroll wheel on the mouse to zoom in and out. It's uh, faster than going over and changing the tools each time. Again, I, I go all the way up and do this instead of marking on these lines because it uh, is a little bit more accurate because you can go up here and then delete the parts that you don't need and then you're for sure on the line itself. Um, so anyway, again, we'll come in here and delete these parts and zoom out. Go ahead and delete the guides again and then we'll go ahead and stop that right there. Oh, hang on. We'll delete these down here. and come out and